Hello Squirrels and welcome to PPM6 TV. Today what it is is a return to Lavalier microphones. I've been testing um, Shaw's latest offering in that area, the uh, Twinplex series, and I've been testing them against the very well regarded uh, DPA6060 which is actually um, considerably smaller and uh, almost you know an industry standard in drama and film because of its uh, very small size and its exceptional sound quality. So sure um, have got a, a big ask if they're going to match. It's a very simple test this today. All I'm going to do is uh, uh, offer you the audio from the two mics side by side and see which you prefer. A very simple A, B test. On the subject of the Twinplex's rationale, um, Sure have really uh, gone all out on two areas. One, uh, sound quality. The, the capsule holds a dual diaphragm uh, uh, element and that offers an increased surface area which Sure believe uh, offers increased um, sound quality and improved off-axis response. But they've also spent a lot of time on the physicality of the mic. They've got a medical grade cable with dual drain wires. They've got um, uh, anti, uh, anti um, sort of sweat and, and liquid uh, coating on the microphones. Um, and they really are uh, offering these as a very robust alternative to uh, some of the competitors. Now, Obviously, when we're dealing with uh, three and four hundred dollar microphones or three and four hundred pound microphones in the UK, we want to treat them very well. But that's not always the case, and particularly in theatre, um, microphones uh, live a very hard life, and so uh, the Lavalier microphones. So um, I think um, Sure have got a, a, a very keen eye on that market and hoping that the Twinplex will make some inroads. Now, um, this increased robustness and increased uh, the, the dual diaphragm element means that they are physically bigger than the something like the 6060 and that I suspect for many people will be a deal breaker that the physical size will just be too big um, but have a look uh, now and see what you think. Now one of the nice things about the Shure in fact one of the I think the tremendously commendable things is the fantastic range of accessories um, that are, come with the mic at no extra cost uh, various clips um, and all sorts of stuff. Now I'm not going to try and include that in this video because I think um, that probably merits a, a look on its own which will just be a short uh, run around what you get in the box as I've said in my other video um, <laughs> the DPA 6060 magnificent beast as it is uh, in the box you get the instruction booklet. And that's it. Now, that's, of course, not a real problem. There, there are plenty of people offering aftermarket, DPA themselves, but other people offering aftermarket clips and all, all manner of fixing uh, technology if you want it. But I, I personally do appreciate the fact that, sure, so you're spending a lot of money, um, you ought to have these things built in. Well done, sure, for that. So there we are. I can reveal now that the Sure Twinplex was mic B and the uh, DPA 6060 was mic A. And I hope that will help you. Um, take some small step towards judging which is right for your application. Thanks for watching PPM6 TV. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Do come back soon. Bye for now.